hey youtube thank you guys so much for clicking on my video um i recreated this look that i did for my 20th birthday and if you want to see how i got the look keep watching all right so i'm starting off with my jaclyn hill ring the alarm palette and the color i'm using is alert As you can see, I'm focusing the eyeshadow on the outer corner of my eye while also winging it out just a little bit. Still using my Jaclyn Hill palette, I dipped into the shade Framed and placed it right underneath the transition shade that I was using before. And I'm going back in with Alert just to blend out my eyeshadow a little bit more and bring back that orange shade. And I went and picked up the new Cut Crease Canvas by Makeup Revolution. Um, in this clip, you can see I was trying to cut my crease with the applicator, but I ended up having to go off camera and cut the crease with one of my Morphe brushes instead. Now I'm just using the same colors I did before to blur out the cut crease and make sure that I don't have any harsh lines. Still using my Jaclyn Hill palette, I went in with the shade Lolly to fill in the part where I cut my crease out. Now all I'm doing is placing a thin line of glitter on top of my crease. Alright, and I did a small wing liner, I did my lashes off camera, and now I'm about to highlight my brow bone. And now all I'm doing is using my Benefit Professional Primer to prime my face. And I'm also um, just moisturizing my lip with a Ulta lip oil that I got. And for foundation, I'm using my NARS foundation. Um, I can't think of the color right now, but I will list it down below. At this point, I realized that I didn't wet my beauty blender, so I had to go wet it, and now I'm back just to blend out my concealer.
I'm just going in with a really bright concealer shade just because I like that really highlighted under eye look. All I'm doing now is going over my entire face with my beauty blender, making sure that everything's blended out nicely. And to contour, I'm using my Fenty Beauty Matchstick in the shade Espresso. And I do find the matchstick a little bit hard to blend out, so I spray my face with Urban Decay's hydration spray before I go in with my beauty blender to blend it all out. And just for the purpose of this video, I did contour my nose, but I usually skip this step in my makeup routine. You can see I keep looking in the camera wondering does it look good, but um, I just kept going and I eventually go in with my beauty blender just to blend out the lines a little bit more. And I did say that it was my 20th birthday, so I was gonna be out all night. So I wanted to make sure that my face was set in place for the whole night. And I kind of just went in a little bit overboard with the setting powder, but it all worked out. And to add a little bit more warmth back into my face, I'm going in with my Fenty Beauty bronzer and going over the places that I contoured at. Now I'm just brushing off all that setting powder that I used and using a pressed powder to set the rest of my face. Using my favorite highlighter by Becca, I'm just going in and highlighting all the high points of my face. And to set my face, I'm going in with my Morphe setting spray. And I'm also going in with my all nighter setting spray. And to finish up my eye look, I'm going in with a milk eyeliner to line my eyes.
Taking the shade Framed from the Jaclyn Hill palette, I'm placing it underneath my waterline. And to blend that shade out, I'm going into my Juvia's Place Masquerade palette and using the shade Zobo right underneath it. Period. It's the look. <laughs> All right, now I'm going in with some mascara and just placing it on my bottom lashes. And looking at this look, I wish I would have invested in some bottom lashes because I think it would have tied the whole look together a little bit more. Now all I'm doing is lining my lips with my MAC liner in the shade Chestnut. I can't think of the shade name right now, but I'm filling my lips in with a L'Oreal liquid lipstick from the Chocolate Collection. And to finish off my lips, I'm going in with my Gummy Cosmetics lip gloss. all I did after that was add a few beauty marks to my face and that's it I was done after that once again thank you guys for clicking on my video I hope you all enjoyed it and I will see you in the next one